Pat Esther Pavoni works obviously in our as a legal man uh, down in our JAG office, our legal office, and uh, uh, just the the quality of work that uh, let let me let me rephrase that the stuff that they do down there. Okay, and everybody you know here's legal men and they think you know NJP and you know this is you know they're you know draw wills and uh, well the Six Fleet JAG office uh, SJA does much more than that. So all of you know our partner nation relation uh, legal issues okay uh, come through there. Am I am I? Yes, Mr. Trying. So, actually, you expound on this a little bit more <laughs> because I think you're, you'd probably be w much more eloquent than. So, um, so I mainly deal with administrative law and ethics portfolio of the FJA office, and really what it entails is yes, like you talked about the military justice piece of the house, um, your NJPs, your DRBs, and um, minor stuff like that. But um, really, what we focus on is eth the ethics. We, ha you know, we work for five admirals. Um, you know, their day to day duties wherever it takes them to Africa to um, to France and, uh, the travel that they do the gifts that they receive the meals that they eat the people that they talk to the the staff that they use everything has to be reviewed to make sure they're in compliance with ethics rules and regulations and everything comes through our office and usually I'm the first chop on a lot of that stuff um, I'll do uh, give my advice and my recommendation to the lawyers who will then actually give the, the real advice to the animals. How many times have you been Sailor of the Quarter? Twice, last Chief. Okay. Have you ever been Sailor of the Year before? In my previous command I was. Okay. Yes. Which was where? The Navy Legal Service Okay. Office. Which was how long ago? Uh, four years ago. Okay. So it's, you know, once again, you know, we, you know, and, and I've seen your performance, you know, since you've been here. You, you, you perform every day. Yeah. You know, every day you bring your A game. Uh, um, when you look back through your record, okay, because as, as part of this program, this this is something we're we're doing is looking back through your record. We we see that track uh, record of sustained superior performance, uh, and I think it when it culminates in selection, okay, as Sailor of the Year, uh, you know, for a uh, a large staff, six fleet staff, you know, uh, you know, uh, I think that speaks volumes. You know, once again. Yeah, you know, about your your performance, obviously, okay, your character and who you are, and what and what you're going to give to the Navy in the future. So, what's your next step? Well, so I have ten months left here. I'm up for orders uh, next month. I recently just finished my master's degree, so I don't have to worry about school, nice. hopefully, ever again. What did you get your master's? No, legal studies. So, um, so now it's focusing. Um, you know, I fo I took care of my personal uh, achievements, and now I, I definitely want to. Be an instructor for the Justice School in Rhode Island. Uh, so hopefully a billet becomes available in January, February, or March when I'm up for orders. If not, you know, anywhere East Coast will be fine after that. Um, preferably Northeast because that's where my husband wants to go.